Hey good people, it is Friday, uh, our first official full day at New York Fashion Week. Yesterday you saw us arrive, hit up H&M. Um, we also went to the Alice and Olivia fitting. I will show you all what I'm wearing tomorrow for that presentation. And we also had a chance to meet up with Tanika B last night. Uh, always enjoy, enjoy spending time with that sister. She is such a vibe. First of all, she's hilarious and I feel like the the hilarity doesn't even come across okay you have to meet her irl for her personality to just shine through she's stunningly beautiful makeup was flawless she had on a beautiful pink suit i said and i also really wanted to steal her jacquemus pink handbag it was a full tonal moment and so uh Kassan and i uh with her obviously had dinner i had oysters i had a salad i had buffalo wings i it was just an amalgamation of crazy stuff i had um some cocktails or some Prosecco. Y'all know I love a cocktail. Cocktails are my love language. Um, and I also had cheesecake for dessert. So <laughs> that was a good first meal. And the location was Lore Fish Bar. We are up. We've been up since about six. It's seven. Actually, it's almost eight now. So we need to get the ball rolling as far as getting makeup on and looks together because both of us are shooting first thing this morning. And the purpose of that, and I don't know if I've shared this with you all before, is to stockpile content so that you're not trying to shoot in real time over the weekend or the week, however long you're going to be participating in New York Fashion Week. Um, I should say that if you were seeing any of my looks here first, you lay. It's because you're not part of the Politics and Fashion tribe, the private community. They get all of the New York Fashion Week content first and exclusive content. So I'll make sure that I link that down below so that you don't miss anything next time around. But we also, of course, have monthly themes, great resources, additional content is there in that community 24 7 not just during new york fashion week but if you are into fashion week content that is where you want to be trust me that's like how do i put it um floor seats at the nba finals okay um so uh let me get my life the makeup the beat has to be done and lately it's been taking me quite a bit of time to put on my makeup. I do not know why. I'm going to shoot three, maybe four looks. And let's get this day started. I would say I'm 72. I remember the first transition to platforms. This is the first original iteration I've seen. They're absolutely gorgeous. Oh, thank you so much. You're awesome. Oh, that was nice. And just like that, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. Yes. Anna, tell us it where to. Amazing. Where can amazing. we find you? On Instagram. On oh, Instagram. <laughs> I'll make sure that her handle is dropped so you all know how to book with her. The pictures are absolutely stunning. I'm sure you've already seen some of them on the screen. But if you have not, you need to be following all of us over on IG. So, girl, where you been? She said it. She said it. Okay, so we are now about to change. Eat, eat the rest of my food. food. These Jimmy Choo's are not Amen. actually made to walk in. <laughs> um, 
and then I gotta run to Alice and Olivia because they didn't have my size yesterday and grab my suit and probably do a little bit of shopping while I'm at it. It's still early, so I feel like I need to put on something that I don't mind actually walking in today. So let's see what we get into. So I am headed now to the Adore Me gifting suite. Change clothes into something much more comfortable because I do have to stop by the Alice and Olivia Soho Boutique. Um, so I am wearing this, um, what is this called? It's basically a jacket that I got from Rent the Runway, but it's part of like a ski outfit. I'll make sure it's linked if I can find it, but it's also part of one of the looks that I shot earlier today and I love it. It's neon and I think it pairs really nicely with the black. The Loewe sweater that I got when I was in Lisbon. Earrings are Natia and Laco. Sunglasses are also Loewe. I'm wearing the Zara high waist faux leather pants and the Zara boots. Just easy to get around town in. And then after I grab the Alice and Olivia suit and also go to the gifting suite by Adore Me, I'm gonna come back here and get dressed for the first show of Fashion Week. to the Adore Me show. Mm -hmm. Get into this look. Get into the shoes. Jimmy, chew me, please. <laughs> Just made it to the Adore Me show and I forgot to show y'all my look. So I'm gonna stand up. Kassan, do you mind? I don't, I don't have any footage of this look. Just got this dress yesterday at HM. I feel like I'm about to like accost him with all of these ruffles. H&M Studio dress, gloves are from Anthropology, earrings are from Anthropology, shoes are from Saint Laurent, and I have my little Valentino micro bag, and that's tonight's OOTD for the show. Good morning. It is Saturday. We've had a slow morning in the bed, uh, mostly posting and getting content up. I actually need to make a to-do list because I feel like right now my eyes hurt because I've been staring at a screen for the past two hours, but I also don't want to miss opportunities to post on platforms that I'm not typically on as much. And so this is going to be a big TikTok few days for me. I want to get my YouTube shorts up. So lots of things will be happening. Make sure you are tuned in across the internet. Uh, let's recap real fast though. Last time I talked to you, we were headed to or either at the Adore Me show. Um, I 
always, always love the inclusivity, the diversity, different bodies, different races, hair textures, all the things. And I did a great job this time around. Um, the show was in three themes. They had Valentine's Day, those looks led, um, and then, uh, bridal and it ended with y2k definitely valentine's day and the bridal pieces were my favorite um and after that we went to the smith which was absolutely delicious for dinner with the fashion girls got to meet fashion sherlock for the first time got to meet kayla kayla walker for the first time um saw g obviously that's my dog saw chi also michaela i mean the whole gang the gang was all there and it was definitely a vibe and it just felt so good to be there and we just congratulated each other on our success and answer questions and share knowledge. It is literally a black fashion family reunion. I don't even know how else to describe it. And I've already shared with you all in the vlog that that's what I'm ultimately here for. And so it was a vibe. Uh, today we are again, taking it slow, but we're waiting on food. We ordered room service. I don't know what's taking so long. I need a latte so bad, so bad. First world problems. Um, and then we're going to go and do a little bit of shopping, head to Bergdorf's because they got all the things and it's like, why not? It's 15 minutes away from where we're staying in Soho. And then at four is the Alice and Olivia presentation. I'm looking forward to that. And I think I am going to see Monroe there. So y'all stick with us. These are some boots that Tashira is about to try on, and I love, love, love these. Like, wow. Hello. I know. We're glad I come to you today. Thank you for these beautiful boots. I thank you for the one known as Dreams Van Nottin for bringing these into my life. And I know they're going to fit. I've seen what you've done for others, and I do it for you, Lord. <laughs> Amen. Are they coming on? Girl. They look like they fit, girl. 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 They fit or not? Girl. When I tell you he's a ram in a bush. Wait for the testimony. Wait for the testimony. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, now those look, uh-uh. Buttons to the other fours, they don't go anywhere. My I feel like it's moving though. Just try hitting one. Yeah. Do you yeah. have people? It's us. It's a little bit. How's okay, it look? It looks a good. Down. A little down. Yeah, good. This is good. Okay, thank you. She can hold it for you. Um, do you mind holding this for me? Sure. What's your name? Camilla. Camilla, I'm Tisha. That's a really nice name. Nice to meet you, Camilla. Thank you for your assistance. You're welcome. Amazing. Thank you. <laughs> we are stuck in an elevator. I uh, was headed to the Alice and Olivia presentation and uh, as luck would have it, I am stuck in the elevator. Uh, some very nice people here. So that's a great thing. Camilla is now uh, the director of this footage and I appreciate that. Uh, Camilla's doing a great job. Uh, and hopefully we'll get out here soon. What do you think, Camilla? Mm, 
Probably. Okay. <laughs> but well, I hear other elevators beeping. Right. There's hope. There's so hope. there's there's hope for us. Uh, uh, stand by. Stay tuned. Game. Okay. Whoever messes up, it's a brand new name. Boom. A. C. C. <laughs> D. D. E. e. F. F. Who's gonna mess G. up? Did you guys have water issues, by the way? Oh, thank God. Let's go. Oh, hallelujah. Let's go. Oh, let's get out for the same. Oh, my God. We're fine. the people so headed out to see what the vibe is down at spring studios actually happy that i'm looking in this mirror because i want to darken up my lip a little bit but my sunglasses are from amazon earrings are by rachel comey got those on the runway the top is amazon as well the skirt is massimo duty it's a wool skirt the boots are from Lulu's. You all probably saw those in Vlogmas. I had a Lulu's haul. Uh, the coat is by Topshop, but I got it from Nordstrom. And the bag that my grandma calls a toilet seat is by Jacquemus. Let's get outside, y'all. Having a major, major fangirl moment with this Aww. one. Tell us where to find you. Oh, I'm Lily Youngie. I am on social and I'm obsessed with my babs. Do you see her eye makeup? <laughs> you see it? It's delicious. <laughs> so I am in the core hydration car. Uh, I love this because all you have to do is text and they whisk a car around. This is a Tesla. Don't ask me what model, but it's nice. <laughs> the inside is amazing. And the driver smells really good. So we're happy, exactly. Uh, we got some core water in the back and I didn't know that core had flavored water. So this one is a lemon extract and this one has pink grapefruit extract. Let's see what's happening at the hydration house.
and just like that new york fashion week is over i am now at the amtrak lounge at penn station Moynihan hall i love this train station it's so comfortable and so i'm about 30 minutes early for my train i got me some cheesecake from magnolia bakery a great way to wrap up the weekend okay i really enjoyed my time down at spring studios it was so nice to meet sis lily a hey, girl just the beauty trust that it did not come across on the camera it was on a different level okay uh and it's always so great to meet people who you follow and who you admire as i've already shared with you all that is one of the reasons why i am here and why i will continue to come the core hydration house was so cute uh i really appreciated the lunch we had small bites there also all the different flavors of water that you all would have seen in the core uber um the whole installation activation was nice they actually were doing hair and makeup so if you want to stop by and like do like a quick freshen up you could do that they tried to give me some hair products i was like i use shampoo conditioner on a good day conditioner um most importantly dax wave grease shea butter and a do-rag and I, I keep some rose water to make sure my scalp is hydrated but most days it's just it's, it's, it's uh, shea butter and rose water. So I don't, I don't need no products. Thank you, friend, though. I was like, thank you so much, but I don't need no hair products. Uh, the space was in Soho, and all I had to do was walk over to my hotel. Everything that I have mentioned this weekend will be linked down in the description box. And I really think that's it. I'm just going to hydrate from all the cocktails, cleanse my liver from all the cocktails, Enjoy my cheesecake, and I will see you good people across the internet. Peace.